Hey everyone, and welcome back to the Binding of Isaac Rebirth. I forgot to open random, now it's there, we're good. Today we'll be playing, not Judas actually, Samson. It hasn't been a Samson run in at least a little bit, so... Samson uh, is that one. Believe it or not, there is the seed if you'd like to play along. I actually remembered right away for once. Leech. I actually don't like the leech. Um, I used to take it, but I actually feel that I shouldn't. Takes me out of control of my red heart um, regeneration. So I, I would take me out of Polaroid invincibility and stuff like that. And uh, I don't want that. But what it does is, of course, kills enemies. Uh, it attacks enemies, it chases them down and stuff, and if it kills them, you get a half heart in regeneration. So it's useful if you plan on using your health up a lot, or like if you're on a dark room run, it doesn't really matter because the um, negative effect is pretty useless, then that's, some time, that's a time to use it because you can keep your red hearts up. Stuff like that. But this early, I don't think it's worth it. Personally. So since I'm Samson, I, I'm just taking that. Uh, since I'm Samson, I have Bloody Lust, which makes it so that each time I get hit on the floor, uh, yeah, do that on purpose. Each time I get hit on the floor, let's do it again. I gain damage up to six times. The first three are 0.5, the next three are 1.67 for a total of up to 6.5. Which uh, is a lot of damage. Just, you know, it is. It's a lot of damage. Can I have a bomb for this room? That'd be awesome. Oops. That's fine. It's all part of the plan on the first floor, obviously. Uh, so it's an okay item, at best in my opinion, but what it does have going for it Ooh. Is taking advantage of it on a floor when you have a lot of... Ooh! Ooh! Give me Steven. When you have a lot of opportunity for healing without losing your Devil Room Chance. Like the first floor, where you don't have a Devil Room Chance. Uh, but what it... What, what I hate about it is just, like, going to the next floor. God dang it, man! That sucks. I hate going to the next floor and then my damage is back to butts. That's never fun. So I can't get either Tinted Rock. I got Little Steve, who will shoot Homing Tears instead of being a one damage up. But I did pick up the uh, Curved Horn, which is two damage up, and that's pretty nice. I like that. We should hang out. Let's go. And yes, I know. The Leech actually works well for Samson. But the idea is that I'm not going to need it by the time that it actually matters. I won't need the damage from taking damage, and I won't need the healing because I won't be taking too much damage. These are the ideals, and usually they work out. Can't go to the curse room, don't have any uh, soul hearts, black hearts stuff. So that's just unfortunate, but kind of expected. Since I got a lot of tinted rocks and not a lot of bombs. Welcome to my life should write a biography. A lot of tinted rocks and not a lot of bombs. That's my story. Alright. Money. I suddenly am starting to get the resources that I didn't get at all on the last floor. And that's kind of nice. Dude, these poops are being real nice to me. Alright, let's see what's in our item room. That gives me five bombs and allows me to choose when to detonate my bombs. I can't drop it, so I'm stuck with that. But that's okay. I'll drop it soon enough, probably? I, I obviously don't have control over when I get a spacebar item, but I'm confident that I'll be able to ditch this item. As soon as I would, uh... Well, not as soon as I would like to, but, like, quickly. I love it. Sometimes it's great. Generally, I would say I'm not a huge fan. But, 
It worked pretty well there. Alright, so that's a shot speed up and it gives me a tarot card. I, I'm pretty indifferent to it. Devil's nice. Really? I'm gonna use the devil here. That's plus two damage. So since my first devil room was in fact not a devil room where I could trade health, I am not guaranteed to get devil rooms in the future, which could be really unfortunate. Oh, need that. All right. So I might be stuck with angel rooms, and generally that's a very bad thing. But if I'm really lucky, it'll be fine. Either because I don't get angel rooms or because because I get sacred heart. One of these things is more likely than the other. Go into the curse room now. See if it's got anything nice for me. I picked up health, so we'll be fine. All right, what are you? Okay, that's actually worth knowing about. For one particular reason. And that is when I find the top secret room, which is either here. Ooh, it can't be here. Oh, I don't like this floor. Nah, it's only got one other location then. Never mind, this is free. Uh, it should be then, right here. Now, if this is one that I like, it isn't. If it were a black heart or an internal heart room, I would be able to do crazy things. Namely, generate however many hearts of that sort that the pill would generate. Really? Does that mean it's here? That's odd. Normally it likes to be next to icon rooms. Two keys and now I'm out of bombs? All right, I'll work with it. Don't have enough money to go to the shop. We out. We out. All right, three and a half hearts. No guarantee of a devil room this floor and nothing to protect my red hearts. Uh, no guarantee of a devil or angel room, sorry. Could go either way, of course, but I don't have any guarantee to learn anything. Whoop, whoop, whoop. All right, we're good. <laughs> That was a huge hitbox, oh well. Now I can take damage and stuff, and of course I get a soul heart for that. Typical. I gotta pick that up before the boss, but not too soon, because that's just how I end up losing it, when I don't really have a reason to lose it. And this way I can build up damage, become beefy. That'll be nice. Right? See, it's not every floor when you're Samson that you get to take advantage of your item. So, yeah. I like that. I get to do that. Of course, there are items that make it totally... Well, never mind me and my plans, then. There are items that make it totally doable, but... Hey. Oof, almost walked into that. Dark Bum, that's actually pretty useful for this run. Uh, picks up red hearts. And every one and a half red hearts it picks up, it'll drop a soul heart, a black heart, a uh, friendly spider, or an enemy spider. So the vast majority of those will be soul hearts. Uh, it's not like, yeah, it was nerfed by making spiders an option. And of course, by originally making it so that it was one and a half instead of one, because it did start at one. Uh, but it, it really, it's so, it's really inconsequential. It's stupidly good, even as is. You don't get that many spiders. So, it's not like it matters. <laughs> oh, I, I really thought that I would have killed it by then. And I failed. All right, so we got lots of damage. Is Gertie? Gertie almost died to my use item. That's why I have it, just to kill bosses, essentially. Because it's not my use item of choice, really. All right, I didn't think so. 
still stuff to do and now I can actually afford the shop so we'll be going there I left a lot of rooms unexplored there could be a curse room or something great like that I don't need any of this stuff so I guess I'll buy these things excuse me I actually wanted that so you know ah well I just spent five cents to walk on spikes that happens to me a lot. That's something that I actually do think that the... Excuse me, Dark Bum. That the original Isaac did better. And it's not better, it's just like... It's more accessible and reasonable. Is that it, there's a lot of time when you enter a room where you can see what's going on in the room before doing anything. And that means that I will still be holding a direction for walking sure but I will have time to see like hey there are spikes here and not continue holding it when I gain control and I appreciate that but of course if I would ever just be a little more patient which isn't going to happen by the way uh, I would never walk into spikes or I could remember the rooms that have the spikes but that's unlikely okay what's well, this one it's this one this one has the golden chest that's I gotcha I only have one bomb, so I'm not going to look for the top secret room. Even though it's probably here, so you know. I'm also not... Oh, it, actually, I'm going to look for it because it like has to be there. If it's not here, it's weird. Dang it, game. Video game, please. I just wanted to get a bunch of black hearts. Not eternal hearts. I don't actually want them. But I'm carrying this pill around, and gosh darn it, I will use it effectively. I appreciate free chests. Handles. Good. Well played. Let's use this to gain money and uh, damage. Ah, much better. Alright, so now I can use my red hearts as damage ups, basically. Because using this doesn't count as red heart damage for the floor, but it, I can do damage to my red hearts instead of my soul hearts. I can also use it to use red hearts to go into curse rooms when I have soul hearts and stuff like that. Uh, through the invincibility, and it's just generally a pretty good item for Samson. But that means I need to steal some red hearts from Dark Bum. Like, for sure. For sure. Okay, I'm into it. Sure. Spiders do two and a half times my damage, so they're, they're pretty, uh, pretty beefy right now. That's for sure. Ah, darn. Darn damage ups, I hate when I get those. So now uh, my pill, hematemesis, is actually a benefit to me. Okay, I'm done taking health ups now. <laughs> Unless I get a devil room that I can actually use. Six hearts, uh, six red hearts is too many, officially. Well, no, six hearts is as many as I'm willing to consider worth having. Anyway, uh, the pill will give me hearts that I can actually pick up now. Which means it's a good thing to use, but until I absolutely need to, I'm not going to. Alright, not worth going in there yet. Maybe later. I got lots and lots of damage for you guys. <laughs> Man, they died fast. Hey, thanks. I could have blown up, but like, whatever, it's too, it's too late. But I could have gotten all four cents and the Tinted Rock, of course. And that would have been a much better plan. But no. Nice. Oh, gross. Okay, we're good. Life is good, and I got my bomb back. Boss has to be soon. Like, there's no way this isn't the direction. See what I tell ya. Okay, that room didn't unfairly damage me at the start. Which is pretty much, but not necessarily, but pretty much the only time it will. Thank you. Oh, I only got two, but that's fine. The pill, of course, sets you to one red heart. Not like, if you're at a half, it will give you a half red heart. So, 
That is something to be careful of. Or even if you use it in a black heart room like that. Um, like late game, you got Polaroid Invincibility, you use it on a black heart. Nope. You're getting your half red heart back and you're at a Polaroid Invincibility. Tough. Uh, I haven't been to the item room. That's actually, I haven't been there. That's amazing. So, Synth Oil, one damage up and some amount of range up is a good item I like. The odds that all the places I go, there's the one path and it's probably like one room long and that's my item room. Okay, it's two rooms long. That's good enough. Mine. I don't need your health right now. Nor your help. I, I can't use that. And there's no reason for me to do anything with it. Uh, now I'll go to the shop. Oof, almost walked into that. Then I would have needed it. Need so many rooms with spikes, please. Uh, I'm gonna pass on those things later, guys. All right. On to the next floor. I have plenty of keys, so it's not a big deal. Whoops. We good. We good. Alright, there we go. Next floor has something for us, I hope. And that's just worth it so I'd start off with a lot of damage. That's harder to do later. That was dumb. It's fine, more damage though. I have plenty of hearts and dark bomb and... I'm really not concerned. I may as well max out damage, but the problem is I actually want to um, replenish my red hearts rather than giving him to Dark Bomb. I don't need it right now from Dark Bomb, so that's why I won't I won't give it to him. If I get some red hearts, I'll use those to go in and out of the uh, first room instead of my... Nope. Instead of my soul hearts. So we gotta wait up. Otherwise I would've gone there right away. I have no doubt. Hey, shoot bomb at me. Help, help, help. That does a full heart too. Dang Teratoma and Fistula. Being really silly amounts of powerful. I was just trying to get someone to blow that up for me. Would've been great. Are you kidding me? Oh, whatever. Now the hearts are a free for all. Whoever gets them, gets them. So many key drops though, that's crazy. Monstro's Lung. The Monstro's Lung allows me to charge up a Monstro attack, basically. I have a lot of shot speed, so it actually travels pretty far if I give it momentum with my motion. It does like stupid amounts of damage. It's a mega good item. That's pretty exciting. That is pretty dang exciting. Oh, nope, mine. Thanks, friend. I'm glad you understand. That's <laughs> so good. I will let you have this one, Dark Bum. Because I'm not going to bomb for it. Oh, fine. Good, good, good. All right, boss is coming up soon, probably. Oops, sure. Sure, sure. Oh, that was dumb of me. I didn't think that would reach me, but it obviously did. Should go to the shop. Oh man, Jar's OP for the same reason that um, Hematomesis is. Alright, so the treasure map gives me the full layout of the floor, just not what the rooms are. 
a lot of the time it's pretty obvious. It doesn't give me either secret room though, by the by. Yeah, I know you're there. This is Def's one? Yes, yes it is. Half of War's health gone. Nice meeting you. Later, friend. In the devil room, all right, cool. All right, you win this round. So that sets my red hearts to zero, gives me six black hearts, 1.5 damage up. 0.2 or so, 0.1 speed up, it's one of the two. And my tears have a chance to be here when they shoot. And since I'm shooting Monstro's Lung, pretty much there's always at least one fear shot, and that uh, fears enemies is kind of bad. I would actually prefer not having fear shot. But that ain't up to me when I take this item. This item's too worth it, though, to just not take fear shot over six black hearts and 1.5 damage up, and, you know, it is, it is too good, man. Too good. Good, good. Yep. I wanted to not shoot. I probably could have gotten away with it. Use a cube of meat would have been really, really easy. Good. Oh, I tried to let go of the shot and it was just like, no, you're getting hit which can't seem to happen on the same frame. It's all right, I didn't need to. I'm doing all right, don't worry. All right, sure. Two thirds guppy now. Dead cat gives me nine lives, uh, where I'll respawn at one heart. It also sets me to one red heart, which is cool. Uh, that's not the right way. And uh, Guppy's Collar, 50% chance to revive at half a heart if I die, and that'll activate any of my deaths along the way. Be like before the dead cat if it has to. If it feels like it, I believe. So that's happening. All right. So we're two thirds Guppy. Yeah, I'm going this way first, which can only portend good things. Yeah. Man, I was so sure I'd get away with it. Then again, my damage hasn't been increased at all yet, and I was using full damage on the last floor. Let's use it once. May as well improve my damage when I can. All right, so the white champion can't be killed until it's the last enemy alive. So I may as well focus on everyone else first. Ah, uh, that's fine. Now everyone else is dead. Oh, but he spawns friends. Jerk. All right. Good. Let's check this out. Yeah. All right. Now we're guppy. That spawns uh, two to four kamikaze flies usable every room, but I don't really need it because I'm Guppy, which makes it so that every time I hit with a tear, I spawn a kamikaze fly that does twice my damage. So a little unnecessary there. Uh, anyway, I know you can do this with one bomb where you get all eight. I've never once successfully done that. I've never gotten more than four at once, and that is why I don't do that. People tell me every time that I don't do it that I can do it, and I know. I just can't do it. So I don't. And that is that story. I'm gonna take it. Then I'm gonna regret it, because I'm gonna wanna use my IV bag. So, that's fine. I acknowledge that it's gonna happen. I know what's going on. Having the treasure map is nice, because I can plan my movements around doing everything in the wrong order, like boss last and actually clear the floor. It'd be great. But, doesn't matter that much, I'm doing fine. Oh, see, that's why I regret it. 
Now's where I determine I don't really need this eternal heart, but I, at the moment I don't even have like extra health besides it. Okay, stop. I'm probably just gonna end up ignoring it. That's fine. I got that. Dark Bone didn't. I'm fine with that. Doesn't make much of a difference to me. Okay. Two of diamonds, sure. That means I get to go to the shop easy. That's the boss and not the shop, believe it or not. Which means I need to go elsewhere first because I still haven't been to the item room. And this floor, I can't leave the boss room without a teleport. Sure, double my bomb count. Not green. Oh god, well, good game. Well played. I'll take the candle too. So Hive Mind doubles the damage of flies and spiders. So flies normally do two times, they now do four times my damage. Uh, this doesn't work with Monstro's Lung and is also a terrible item and I won't spawn any flies, so that's not happening. Uh, yeah. So that that's pretty insane. What I just got there. Dr. Fetus is also special, sadly. So that means I'm less likely to get other actually good special items. Yeah, that's how much damage those do. Well, this is going to the chest. Because it's too good not to. I'm going to drink some water, if you'll excuse me a moment. All right. I have no idea where I'm going, thanks to this darn curse of the... whatever this curse is called. Curse of the whatever this curse is called. Lost is the one I'm looking for. Nope, don't need that. Please don't dead end me. Okay, we're not dead ended. The lovers. Sure, dark bum. I know you're interested. Oh, and you even gave me one of them. Yeah, spiders would do five times my damage, which is pretty wild. I'm not going to need to use the candle. I'm just also, like, at this point, the other thing is too expensive to actually be very worthwhile. Because it's only, I'd get one use out of it this floor. I don't have enough red hearts, and it's not doing enough compared to what I've already got. It'd be worth keeping over the candle, even if I won't use the candle. At least I can use the candle if I need some nice benefit, basically. Four times my damage is also pretty good. These flies. Candle does like 23 damage per hit. Yeah, there was a Tinted Rock. Um, candle does like 23 damage per hit and can hit a bunch of times, approximately. God, this is insane. Is this a dead end? No, oh, good. I've been a little upset if that had been a dead end. There was no way, in my eyes at least. So it's gonna be left this time. Whenever I go, or sorry, right. Whenever I go right, when it's right or up, it's up. Whenever I go up, it's right. It's like, oh, you were running short on flies. Don't, uh, don't worry about it. I'm Monstro's lung. I'm here to help. Goodbye, friend. Another tinted rock. Range up, I like. I will certainly take one damage up and three black hearts. And then I will leave. I don't really need the Polaroid invincibility or anything. Now I know where I'm going. Thank goodness. I don't really need that either. Don't really need that either. Whoopsie. Good job. Stuff just kind of like dies in my wake. Also, when did my fire rate get better? I, I don't recall getting an improved fire rate, but it feels like my fire rate has improved. I I'm just gonna guess it hasn't. I'm sorry, Polycephalus. But like, it feels like it has, which is what really counts. All right. And away we go.
So now we're in the cathedral. Where? We have Curse of the Blind anyway, so I guess it's good. That means hopefully I won't get Curse of the Blind on the chest. Because that would be sad. I wish Dark Bum could take Eternal Hearts. If I really tried to let him. Then he spit out like 20 hearts. That would be really OP if he spit out that many hearts. I feel like four times my damage is acting like a lot higher than it should be. No Tinted Rock. Miraculous. Oh, oh I walked into it. I'm not gonna go back. I don't really need to. <laughs> I'm feeling okay about things right now, believe it or not. Believe it or not. Okay, that opens both the secret and top secret rooms for me. For the floor. I probably did pass the secret room. I'll go back for it. Which means I can grab the soul heart as well. See, I was just waiting for the opportune moment, which was right then and there. Go back to here. Fight greed and get a steam sale, because I really desperately needed one. Half off in all the shops. Maybe I'll get... Uh, an error room with a shop in it. I actually would need the steam sale because I only have 16 cents. Alright. Oh, you wouldn't let me grab everything. Okay. Goodness gracious. Go up there. Oh wow, I barely made that. That's for sure. That's good. No curse. Beautiful. Oh dear. Oh dear. Infestation 2 means every time I kill an enemy I get a spider. Uh, $3 bills, a random tier effect each room. And then I picked up something else that does something else. Oh, Aquarius. I track tears on the ground behind me. It's worthless. It's a terrible item. Don't pay attention to it. I guess I'm clearing the floor. More chance for cool tier effects. Oh, and that. That can also happen. Which would be terrifying. So you know. In case it did ever happen. Hopefully it doesn't. Three soul hearts adds the Bible to a bunch of the pools. A bunch of times. It's terrible. Just because of the Bible. Because the Bible's useless in this game. Don't even need these drops, man. Where, where did all the enemies I killed to get all these spiders come from? Segmented enemies like Chubb should turn into three, but that seemed to turn into like 69. Like where are all of these spiders coming from? I don't understand. How am I so powerful? Help me. But since they do five times my damage and, like, the flies are already destroying everything, I don't even know anymore. You're gonna regret this, friend. Sadly, in its invincibility frames at the start, it does take away most of my flies and spiders and things. So, it still gets something of the last laugh at the very least. Ah, that's what the sides look like right now. Mysterious liquid. Again. Uh, what was that? Probably number one. Yeah, because I charge really fast. I don't know what I have right now. I, I don't know what I have for this room. That's fine. Oh god, explosions. Not the question, but the answer. Alright. It was nice knowing you all. By the way, when the spiders kill uh, enemies, what did I even get? Spear shot. Okay. Now I know. When the spiders kill enemies, you don't get another spider, but when the flies do, you do. 
And that's nice. I don't think I picked up any new items. I don't think there were any new items for me to pick up. But I'm at 335. That's pretty good. So that will do it for today. I hope you enjoyed the episode. Thank you for watching. I will see you next time.